Hello and good morning, everybody. It is I, Grand Right, and here we are back with another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Crystal with our Gen 2 type challenge of Fire Type. Um, I do apologize for my last uh, Pandora's Box stream. I had my microphone muted, and I'll make sure to mention that in the Pandora's Box stream that I do next. Rectify what I can. But yeah, we're going to be continuing on here with our second Fire Type team. Heading towards Goldenrod. And taking on Whitney. Now we're going to head back here really quick to Azalea to pick up a charcoal. Alright, so let's teach Cut really fast. Let's give this charcoal to uh, Charmeleon. Then we'll give this berry to Ponenta. All right, now let's make our way through the forest. Shouldn't take us too long here. Wanna get headbutt, of course. Yeah, everybody but Ho -Oh can learn headbutt. We're gonna be teaching headbutt. Ponita for sure. We'll teach it in place of uh, Tail Whip. And the next fight we get, we'll move it up. Oh my goodness. Peep through this little fight here. We get sweet scent. And then just continue onwards. So Whitney should pose a Bit of a challenge, being that, of course, her milk tank goes roll out, and her milk tank is milk tank. Sliding. Why are you sliding? You're just not gonna work with me, are you? Headbutt the Spearows, these are just low level trainers. Burn through the Snubble. Headbutt. So now ho -Oh here against the Diglett. And then we'll swap uh, Quilaba. Let's 
So I did start a little earlier this morning than I usually do, but that's because I just have some meetings later today. I wanted to make sure I had plenty of time. To get the shave in before though. Hopefully we'll be back later though with another episode. We'll just have to see how things go. <clears throat> what comes up. Of course, we get undisabled right as we're about to take down the side up, but that's okay. We're gonna hop into the mart really quick. We're gonna buy a couple TMs here, sell a couple items. So let's sell this X accuracy, these X attacks. And this X defend. And these Pokeballs. Sweet Scent and Fury Cutter. So we want to buy two more headbutts for sure. So we want to buy an elect a Thunder Punch for later. And then I think we can teach a Fire Punch. So we're going to go ahead and buy that already as well. Yeah, I thought Charmeleon could learn Fire Punch already, which is exactly what we want. Fire Punch is much stronger than Ember. We'll keep that until we get Flamethrower. Let's get the bike. We can't teach Thunder Punch yet. But we will be teaching that whenever we get uh, Typhlosion, because Typhlosion can learn it. Let's get the radio. And let's go to the underground. Good deal. Let's get some experience here on ho -Oh. Swift. Sacred Fire, the Magnemite. Swift, the Voltorb. Good level up. We'll just keep ho -Oh up since ho -Oh is a slower leveler. We got paralyzed by that Magnemite. Okay, well, I guess we're going to switch because ho -Oh missed... All of its sacred fires and such. Switch up Charmeleon. So let's see, let's swap those up and then we're gonna fire punch.
Good damage. Should have just stuck with the uh, fire punch. back in the heel. Burr. It was a little warm in here. So like open my door just to get a bit more air with my heater. And then like the air outside of here is cold. Alright, let's heal up and then we gotta level up to level 20 with everybody. So we'll start that. There's 19 for Charmeleon. Amelia is trying to learn to rage. We'll learn that in place of scratch. Might as well. Let's swap up a ho -Oh, so it would take the longest, so we'll swap up ho -Oh. Let's go. Nope, not you. We're just gonna swift through everything with ho -Oh. Get a few sacred fires off when we can. I'm thinking we will have to go heal with ho -Oh at least once to have enough swifts to get up to level 20. be level 20 there. Yep. Alright, let's swap a Ponita. Yeah. 
I just want to use up these embers since Ponita's special is lower than its attack. I want to try to learn stop here. We'll get rid of the tackle and place the stop. Let my tracker fix itself since I did go a little fast there. The headbutt is just a little stronger than Stomp. level 20 for Ponita. Which leaves Quill Lava for the level up. Now Quill Lava, I mean, I know Charizard and um, Charizard and Typhlosion have the same base stats, um, but the detriment that Quill Lava has right now to Charmeleon is he doesn't have hands and couldn't learn Fire Punch. But Quill Lava does have our accuracy reducing move with Mud Slap, and I guess we do have a Smoke Screen somewhere else as well. I think that's actually on Charmeleon. there. But all things considered, even having a legendary, that didn't take too long. We'll heal up and we're ready to go take on Whitney's gym. Start out here with Quilava against this first beauty. Another ember. This one does survive just a bit. Second one should take it down. Let a defense curl, we'll just do another ember. And then a quick attacks before it goes down. Good deal. We're gonna swap Ponita up for these meowths. Headbutt it. See if we get a flinch. The big thing is that we're faster than it. So it doesn't bite us and get us a flinch. Good deal. We'll 
we'll let ho -Oh take on the Snubble that comes up next. Sacred Fire! And then we'll let Charmeleon take on these jiggly puffs. I think we're just fire punching each one. Looks like it. Alright. Let's swap up Ponita. Let's... Do I just have a potion in here? I do. Let's just go in. To Whitney. We all ready. Alright, here we go. Speed past the toss out just because the, it seems that the cries sometimes mess up our tracker. Headbutt the Clefairy. Half health, that's good. It does get off a metronome. Uses a lovely kiss and doesn't affect us. Second headbutt should take it down. Yep, good deal. We'll swap to ho -O here. Now remember, ho it was times four weak to the Miltank's rollouts. We're really just hoping, you know, if Ho doesn't take Miltank down, to drop a burn on it with uh, Sacred Fire. Because Sacred Fire has a higher chance of burning. And look at the damage that it did to ho just with a tier 1 rollout. We do get the burn on it. Excellent. Which means this is going to do half damage. And we should take it down here with the second Sacred Fire. But yeah, ho would have went down to that second rollout if we had not burned it. Alright. It's hard to believe that it was faster than our ho -Oh, but... You know, it is what it is. Alright, let's just swap you up. And get you to level 21, since you're pretty close now. Heal up. Kim Schwift Sand True Good level up, good deal. We have a Meryl coming out next. We'll swap over to our Ponita. Headbutt it. And do it again. Swap up Ponita.
We'll just stomp on this Pikachu. Stomp on the Diglett. I should get opponent to the 21. And then we'll swap over to... That uh, doesn't matter. Quill Lava. Headbutt. And then we'll Ember the Zubat. Alright. Let's just keep trucking. Good damage to the Magmar with a flinch. Golava's trying to learn quick attack. What do we know here? Uh, we'll replace Leer with it, sure. Swap to Charmeleon for the other Magmar and headbutt it. it. Fire Punch. Done deal. Charmeleon gets 21. We'll just swap Hobo back up and see about leveling it up again really quick as we swift through some Volt Orbs. I'll fix my tractor here in a sec. I guess I switched a little too fast. Take out these Pidgeys. Oh, this Pidgey and Pidgeotto. Get the TM for rollout, and then we're gonna run up here and talk to the girl by the pseudo Wudo once I stop getting attacked by Abras. Squirt bottle. Sacred fire, the snubble. Now, when Ho levels up here, we're going to learn Gust. Our first flying type attack. When it levels up. Which was not right now. There we go. Then we'll swap over here to Charmeleon, and we're gonna fire punch this cubo. And then we're going to swap up said Charmeleon. And we're going to go get the TM here for Dig.
And we will be teaching Dig. We're gonna teach it to Charmeleon. Since Quilava knows Mud Slap right now. Do the place of rage. And now we know two ground attacks. Now eventually, Typhlosion will be getting Earthquake in place of Mud Slap. And Charmeleon will be losing his ground type attack altogether at some point because we'll alert wing attack Dragon Rage. But for right now, we have this nice big old Raichu that we can dig against. For massive damage! Fire punch this Oddish. Then we'll dig against the Volt Orb. All right, let's swap up Ponita. with the two Abras and the Kadabra. We're just gonna stomp on the Abras and we'll headbutt the Kadabra. And then we have a Tangela that we could just Ember. We do have Pseudo Wudo next. I'm gonna switch to Charmeleon here. Even though it's not very effective, Charmeleon should do some good damage with Fire Punch, or not. There we go. Alright, let's swap up Cool Lava. Uh, let's get Rock Punch real here really quick. A Rock, not Rock Punch, Rock Smash. Mm, good critical hit, Headbutt. Sonic Boom from a Metronome. Drowsy. Alright, let's get this bill conversation out of the way. Heal up, and then we're gonna go buy our awakenings that we usually do. Other stuff to sell. I have some TMs to sell. Okay. Now the Kimono Sisters are going to be interesting. We'll let Kowava take on the Flareon. Good flinch. Sand attacks us, we cook attack. Good deal. Good deal, Quilava. Let's swap up. 
Charmeleon. Not that I think it really matters whom we use against Espeon. Swap up Ponita for Umbreon. Headbutt. Good deal. Then we're gonna let ho -Oh take on the dangerous one. back up. Sand attacks us back. Let's swap up ho -Oh to start against our rival, just because he starts off with Haunter here. We do get Surf. Let's heal up. And let's go take on our rival. Let's guess it. Hunter's got low defense, Hoa's so got high attack, and this is stab. And takes itself out with a curse. Excellent. Alright, let's swap over to Ponita. Ponita, thank you. Zubat coming out next. We'll just keep Ponita out and head butt. And then we're going to swap, of course, our Quilava up to face his Quilava. Oh, 
Alright, we dropped his accuracy, he dropped our accuracy. But we missed the attack. He does not. Oh, come on, Quilava. We've had one accuracy drop, he's had two. Now it's time to level up to uh, 25. See how long it takes us here. Nurse 24 for ho -Oh. and Now ho -Oh will take the longest, so... But we can kinda give us ourselves the edge against these coffings with Safeguard. There's 25 for Ho-Ho. We do have two Pokemon at half health right now. Oh, that is a wheezing. Got it. There's the poison. Alright. Let's go back and heal. I can dig out of here. I have Charmeleon Nose Dig. There's 24 for Ponita. Let my tracker catch up, give my head a scratch. There's 25 for Ponita. Excellent. Swap up Charmeleon. Thank you.
And we can just fire punch the coughings with Charmeleon. They won't stay to chance. Remember, coughings have really low, or not really low, they're out of de their defenses. Their special defense is lower than their physical defense. So using like fire punch is exactly what we want to do. And Charmeleon, not only getting a stab fire punch, has the charcoal to power it up even more. And let's swap up Koalava. It's just Ember. That was a good cri critical hit, Ember. Level 24. I was hoping we were going to learn Flame Wheel. I know we're getting close to uh, Palava learning it. There's 25 for Quilava. And we'll dig out of here. Heal up. And because I want to try to take on Morty without using ho -Oh, we're going to use ho -Oh against the uh, intro trainers. Alright, we're just going to keep that up a few more times. And that'll do it for this trainer and getting ho up to level 26. Well, there went our Poison or paralysis cure berry. I don't think I have any other berries. I don't. Okay. So let's swap the Ponita. level does collab below flame wheel? Thirty-one. So Charmander is definitely going to be our fire attacker for the time being, or for a while. She shall win. Burn the ghost. Critical hit lick. Keep going, Bonita. Okay, so it does curse us. So we should be able to take it down and then we can swap. We'll swap over to Quillava. Mud slap it. Sp 
bite it, our mud slap, which is actually a, a good one to mud slap since it's only got a Pokemon power of 10. We'll heal up. And then we're gonna let Ponita still start out here. Hopefully level up off this Ghastly. Does trying to learn fire spin. Eh, might as well in place a growl. Got a haunter coming out next. We'll swap over to quote lava. Mud snap it. Good damage. Alright, it curses. So one more mud slap will take it out. And then we swap the Charmeleon here for the Gengar. Okay, it does get the Hypnosis off. There's a miss, we dig. Half damage, All right? We need one more. Ahaha! Ah. That should do it. We'll just keep Charmeleon out and Fire Punch. Okay, we are not going anywhere. Second fire punch takes it down. Which we are going to teach to ho -Oh. Since ho -Oh has very high attack, we're going to teach him to place a safeguard. We just want to utilize ho -Oh's attack. Let's heal up, get that fog badge. And then we'll swap up Quilava. And give this a save, and we're going to end this episode here. So like I said, hopefully we'll be back later today with another episode. Hope you all did enjoy, and we'll see you next time.